when challenges and issues come back to back to back to back and it seems like something is after me something is attacking me something is attacking my journey a setback is a setup for the greatest blessings of all times how you handle rejection determines whether you will be successful in life do you know what rejection does to self esteem do you understand how personal this is because it's not just that the door is closed the closing of the door says you ain't no man you ain't no man you ain't nothing and this is a crisis and it brings up every negative thing that has ever been said about you in your whole life when crises strike in your life and in the chinese language crisis mean danger but it also means opportunity you get to make a choice is failure going to break you or is failure going to make you you get to decide failure does it it's not in falling that makes us failures it's in not getting up that makes us failures and you get to decide if you get up or you don't get up stay the course you listening Stay the course. Get off the pity party. Stop running around here feeling sorry for yourself, like you're the victim. Be more responsible for your choices. You're not a victim. You are a victor. And the only thing stands between your success, the only thing stands from you doing what you know you've been called to do. The only thing is you. Nobody can stop you. You are the only person that can stop you. So stop talking like a victim. Stop thinking like a victim. Stop acting like a victim and walk into your destiny. Walk into your destiny, bro. Walk into it. You got to learn how to become resourceful. You got to learn how to become creative. Things are going to get harder, things are going to get tougher. That's the way life works. So, what you need to do is you need to get harder and you need to get tougher. All you do is you fall down, get back up again, fall down, get back up again, fall down, get back up again. That's how you win. We're going to take setbacks. We're going to take some defeats from time to time in our lives. And when that happens, what that actually does and what that actually should do is make your vision clear. Make your mission clear. It's a mindset. And if you change your mindset, mindset is important because we cannot solve our problems with the same thinking we use to create them. You got to change the way you think. All you need to do is change your thinking and you change your world. You don't need to change anything else. The difference between the weak and the strong is that when the strong have no more left, they fight, they fight, they fight. The weak, they quit, they give up, they give in, they surrender, they retreat, and there's nothing weak about you. This life is relentless. You better keep coming back from all your failures, all your doubts, all your sh. You better keep fighting, keep getting up. You are a warrior, and it's time for you to fight. Weakness will not be in my heart. No one will deny me. No one will define me. And no one will tell me who and what I am and can be. Defeat, retreat, those are not in my words. I don't understand these definitions. But I do understand this. I understand victory and I understand never surrendering. Because no matter how bad things go, my heart and my mind will carry my body when my limbs are too weak. Who am I? I am a champion. History will remember me, and no one will tell me what I can and cannot be. I will never give up, not knowing I've given everything I've got. Because who am I? I am a champion. This is not the time to tap out. If you do not give up, if you do not give in, if you fight back, you can beat it. You can beat it. I know you can beat it. You can get through this. You can get on the other side of it, but you can't wish your way out of it. You can't want your way out of it. You can't talk your way out of it. You gotta fight your way out of it. And I know you have what it takes. I know you have that warrior inside. And now I just need you to activate it. I need you to bring it to life. This thing will not beat you. You're bigger than this thing. I may be crying, but I'm gonna keep on walking. I may be hurting. But I'm gonna keep on walking. I don't know how long I have to walk. I don't care if it's another seven days and another ninety miles. I've come too far to give up now. Walk when you don't know where you're going. Walk when you don't see your way clear. Walk when your heart is broken. Walk when you're under distress. Walk when you run out of money. Walk when your friends betray you. Walk when they're down on you. Walk when what 
you imagine doesn't happen. If you fight and do not give up, if you fight and do not surrender, if you fight and you do not fear, if you fight and do not break, you will break that thing that's coming up against you. And victory is on the other side.